Hello, everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we'll explore the fascinating world of love and its impact on our brain. Love is a complex emotion that has captivated humans for centuries, but have you ever wondered what happens in our brain when we fall in love? In this video, we'll delve into the neuroscience behind love and discuss how this powerful emotion can both positively and negatively impact our brain functions. So, grab your favorite snack, sit back, and let's dive into the science of love. Part 1. The Chemistry of Love Love isn't just an abstract concept. It's a biological phenomenon driven by the release of certain chemicals in our brain. When we're attracted to someone, our brain releases neurotransmitters like dopamine, oxytocin, and serotonin. Dopamine is the pleasure chemical responsible for the feelings of euphoria and excitement. Oxytocin, often called the bonding hormone, fosters emotional connections and deepens our social bonds. Serotonin contributes to our overall happiness and mood regulation. These chemicals work together to create a profound sense of attachment to our loved ones. Using functional magnetic resonance imaging, fMRI, and other neuroimaging techniques, scientists have studied the brains of individuals in love. They found that specific brain regions, such as the ventral tegmental area, VTA, and the nucleus accumbens, light up when we experience romantic love. These regions are associated with reward processing and motivation, explaining why we feel driven to pursue and cherish our loved ones. The brain's prefrontal cortex, responsible for decision-making and critical thinking, can also be temporarily altered when we are in love, which may explain why we sometimes make irrational decisions when it comes to love. Have you ever felt like you were addicted to love? Well, there's a scientific basis for that feeling. Studies have shown that the same brain regions activated when we're in love are also associated with drug addiction. This is why love can be an intense emotional experience, causing us to become infatuated and crave the presence of our partner. However, just like any addiction, an excessive focus on love can have negative consequences, leading to issues like codependency and emotional distress. While love can bring immense joy and fulfillment, it can also have damaging effects on our brain. Heartbreak, rejection, or the end of a relationship can trigger a cascade of negative emotions that impact our mental well-being. Studies have shown that heartbreak activates brain regions linked to physical pain, leading to the concept of emotional pain when love goes wrong. Moreover, prolonged periods of stress associated with relationship problems can have detrimental effects on brain health, affecting memory, cognitive function, and emotional regulation. On the positive side, being in a loving, supportive relationship can benefit our brain health. The presence of a loving partner can reduce stress and anxiety, leading to improved overall well-being. Studies have also suggested that individuals in happy relationships tend to experience better brain health as they age. The emotional support and companionship provided by a loving partner can have a protective effect on our brain and cognitive abilities. Did you know that love can impact our longevity? Researchers have found that people in happy marriages or committed relationships tend to live longer than those who are single or in unhappy relationships. Love and social connections have been linked to better immune function and reduced risk of chronic diseases, contributing to a longer and healthier life. And there you have it, the intricate relationship between love and our brain. From the release of chemicals that foster emotional connections to the activation of specific brain regions associated with reward and motivation, love is truly a remarkable and complex phenomenon. While it can bring joy, fulfillment, and even improve brain health, we must also be aware of its potential negative impacts when things go awry. Remember, love is a powerful force that should be nurtured and cherished, but it's also essential to maintain a healthy balance in our relationships and prioritize our mental well-being. We hope you enjoyed this deep dive into the neuroscience of love. If you did, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit the notification bell to stay updated on all our exciting content. Until next time, take care and spread the love.